Hey, what is up guys? It's Kevin Aberger and today I have some pretty interesting news about Call of Duty, so make sure you subscribe right now so you don't miss any other videos I make. And uh, without further ado, let's get right into the video. So, the other day, which was Tuesday, June 7th, T. Martin made a video that he got a package from Activision and Call of Duty, and probably some other popular YouTubers did too. I just heard it from T. Martin. And um, he wasn't allowed to open it till the next day, which was yesterday, Wednesday, June 7th. And so he finally opened it, and it was an invitation to the COD XP event of 2016. They had one of these in 2011 with the announcement of Modern Warfare 3, but they haven't had one since. And now they're having another one um, with the announcement and release of, obviously, COD 4 Remastered and Infinite Warfare. And it's going to be going on September 2nd through 4th, uh, 2016. And um, the one in 2011 featured like real stuff from the Call of Duty games. Like the, there's a burger joint from Modern Warfare 2 that you could actually eat at and stuff. And there's some of that stuff in this one. Plus um, other things. So the first thing, they're going to have the COD World League Championship. Which is the first year of Call of Duty World League. And um, it really launched Call of Duty into the esports a lot more and um, they're having a tournament there and it's the championship and it's going to be worth two million dollars for the competitive players that are going to be playing and that is huge because in 2011 they had one and it was only worth a million dollars now they're doubling that and you can watch it at the XP event live if you go there um, it will be playing live, also playing through the Black Ops 3 uh, a shortcut that you can watch it through and um, where they normally stream it. Also, for Infinite Warfare and the COD 4 reveal, they are going to have places where you can play the Infinite Warfare multiplayer and zombies. And that is really interesting because people want to know what the game's going to be like. So that's really interesting. Of course, the Black Ops 3 uh, beta, which they've said they're doing a beta for Infinite Warfare, that was released in August. So who knows if the beta will be out or not yet or what they're doing with that. Also, you can get to play COD 4 Remastered. And uh, that is also cool. You get to play the Black Ops 3 DLC pack number four and that is very interesting as well and you could get to try that out and they're also going to have 6v6 tournament tournaments for prizes so that's that and then they're also going to have some live action activities to do which is this is really cool they're going to have paint ba paintball able to be used on nuketown and um there's going to be a real nuketown map that you can play paintball on and that'd be really really cool to see or to play on they're also going to have zombies laser tag which i think would be really interesting and uh i wonder how that's going to work that'd be really cool they're also going to have a playstation virtual reality where you get to try to fly a jackal flyer which is the jet from infinite warfare and um, that should be really interesting and cool and it's on PlayStation now the tickets for this event uh, there are three of them and they go on sale on June 11th at 10 a.m. Pacific time and if you're planning on going or if you think e there's even a possibility of going I would recommend you get these as early as you can because they're going to sell out very quickly. So the first type of ticket is called the enlisted ticket, which is $50, and it gets you access to the event, obviously, and it also gets you Black Ops 3 and Infinite Warfare digital content download. So I don't know what that's going to involve, probably a camo and a calling card or something like that. Um, there's also the veteran ticket, which is $130, you get all the stuff from the enlisted ticket, plus you get a studio Q&A, so you could probably ask questions about Infinite Warfare and COD 4 Remastered, I'm assuming. And you get the Legacy Edition of Infinite Warfare, so that's the one that includes COD 4 Remastered and whatnot. And then there's the Prestige Ticket, which is the most expensive, at $200. You get everything in the enlisted and veteran, and then you also get VIP access, so VIP lines and lounging areas. You get uh, the gameplay times, scheduled gameplay times for like the Nuketown and Zombies Laser Tag and probably like the uh, multiplayer for Infinite Warfare times. Um, there's also a four day, three day parking pass and um, a digital deluxe copy of Infinite Warfare which is uh, $100 itself so that's, that's a pretty good deal. So 
hopefully you guys are excited for that I know I am I probably may not be going because I, I can't get to Los Angeles I live in Indiana so um, I probably won't be there however uh, I am excited to see some infinite warfare gameplay and see what goes on there and um, so hopefully you guys are excited too if you are be sure to leave a like and make sure you subscribe down below so you don't miss anything else and um, comment down below what you think of this COD XP event and it's been Caffeinated Burger and I'll see you all in the next video thank you for watching